Hi, this video is from interview.com. Interview.com is a job portal. If you are looking for a job, you can log on to interview.com and you can post your resume with us. In this video, I'm going to talk about very simple Java and equation. What is inner class in Java? Explain. Inner classes are class within class. Inner class instance has special relationship with outer class. So this is outer class and this is inner class outer class and inner class. The inner class has a special relationship it with the outer class. This this special relationship gives inner class access to members of the outer class. So members of the outer class they can access as if they, they are the part of the outer class. The inner class instance has access to all members of the outer class public, private and protected. Let's see an example so that you can understand. So I have written a written a program where you have an outer class and I have written an inner class. Inner class inside this inner class there is a method which is which belongs to this inner class and I am trying to access the variable here. Okay. So let me try to access a public variable as well. Public you can access the public variable from the inner class method. Let's debug and check how exactly it works. So we have created we are creating this is the way you should create the object for the inner class. Can you see this is a little bit different? Usually we used to create an object using new operator and, it and the class name but here we are having a different syntax to create the object of inner class so I'm, I have created the object of inner class I am calling this method which is inside the inner class okay and I am trying to access both private and public variables so why do we need inner class in object oriented way I want to keep the I want to keep classes which are which are uh, closely related within a single class so for example if, if you have if you are implementing GUI uh, clients client part say if you want to have uh, action listeners for your uh, form buttons and all the controllers combo box everything and you don't have to keep the action listeners outside the class because they are very close together close closely related you can have the inner class together okay in a together with the outer class so in object oriented way I'm to simply say I am keeping the classes which are closely related in a single class. That's where inner class comes into picture. Hope this video is useful for your Java interview preparation. Thank you and all the best for your interview. If you like this video, please press the like button. Thank you.